Hello everyone, this is Ricky, and today we're working on problem 35 from chapter 22. We're told that W, X, Y, and Z are different monodentate ligands, meaning they only interact at one coordination domain on the metal. And we're asked how many geometric isomers are there for each ion. And we're given a square planar ion, nickel W, X, Y, Z, and a tetrahedral ion, zinc, W, X, Y, and Z. And so this question really depends on your understanding of the different complex types where geometric isomers firstly can exist with tetrahedral compounds or cannot exist with tetrahedral compounds even though they can with same compounds. All right. So in the square planar case, we have three different geometric isomers. And this has to do with the way that Everything is arranged in space. Please excuse my drawing. This is all supposed to be in a single plane. And if we rearrange the different ions or ligands, uh, we have different stru structural isomers. On the other hand, in the tetrahedral case, um, it only exists in a single form. because it is 3D and can rotate uh, in the 3D space, whereas square planar molecules are two-dimensional and they do not have the, that luxury. So I hope this video was helpful and I'll see you in the next